everyone and welcome back. Uh, it's uh, Sunday morning, October the 6th, uh, on my way to a job involving a structural uh, yellow jacket nest. Um, we're not sure where exactly the nest is. From what I was told, they're entering um, over the porch uh, where the soffit meets the wall. It's actually a soffit and a stone wall on the outside and on the inside is uh, the, the, uh, the living room. So um, the nest is either in the roof of the porch above the, uh, the vinyl um, soffit sheets, I guess, up in the framework of the porch or it's um, within uh, the wall. And the uh, customer mentioned they could see the yellow jackets carrying stuff out. And I just mentioned to them it was either larva or, you know, insula if they're expanding the nest, it'd be like insulation or whatever is in there. So they can take that out to make the nest bigger. And uh, sometimes they also, they would always take out larva too or waste. Um, so it uh, sounds like it could be a challenging one. Um, but, you know, I, I always like a challenge. Uh, it's about 10.25, um, so. And at these jobs, usually I spend um, structural nests like this, I, it could take up to two hours, hopefully it won't take that long, but um, it just depends on uh, where it is and if I can find it. I got that infrared thermometer, so um, hopefully that'll uh, help me out um, if it's a tricky one to, tricky one to find, because um, you never know with, um, Structural nests like um, like these, um, you know, there's they're soffit, there's um, the um, the studs and you know joists they run through, so the nest could be in a certain void, but um, you might have to they might go between uh, they might go down underneath another um, stud to to get to the nest. So like you never know when you make a cut, you could cut it open, and then there's like a stud you hit, and then you got to make another cut. So try to make as few um, cuts as possible. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, you know, see you when I get there. All right. I used the uh, infrared thermometer. We don't think it's in the house. It was 65 degree reading oh, the whole time. Sorry, to go for my face. Um, so I got this uh, zip tool. I'm gonna open up the soffit. I think the nest is actually up in here somewhere in the framework of the porch. Very busy, uh, big German yellow jacket nest. Swarming all over, but see you once I get this uh, soffit opened up. So I'm just narrating the video. So we got to the opening up the soffit. Um, the customer here knows a little bit more about how to open up soffit with the take out the nails and stuff. So they're suiting up. I am unsuited because I really don't know how to take down soffit. I'll admit. So I know I'll get some comments here making fun of me. So bring on the bring on the heat. Um, so once the customer gets suited up, they're going to take down the rest of the soffit. Once, We're just watching once you. Once I get close, cause... I'm probably going to film from over there. <laughs> and now, the gloves, you take the rest, grab this in your rest, okay. and then you put on... Got it. It's the, the right glove or the left glove. Okay. The customer and I are about the same size, so it works out pretty well. Okay, good luck, Joe. Alright, do you have a preference which hospital we send you to? <laughs> yeah. No, I don't care. Um, I'll see what I can do. Um, you're suited. You see him? You see that five-gallon bucket I have? 
Yeah. I have some flying insect killer in there, so if they get real aggressive, feel free to hit them with that. Okay. Sounds good. Shot of me. It's probably a safe bet. Yeah, they're ventilated too, so if it's a breeze, you can feel the breeze. Yeah. You see anything? I can't because there's a, uh, ooh, hopefully I didn't get into the heating duct. There's a, okay. there's a heating duct or something. All right. There. As I get this next one down, you'll see that the board... Ah, damn it. Yep. Yep, they're going. They're going down. Okay, so it's... Shoot.
I was hoping it would be all sitting right here. Yeah. Take that one down. I'm going to. And then let Chris take back over. Yeah, it's hard to tell. They're going in behind the, the stone. The okay. Stone and the brickwork. That's not actually. That's not a heating duct. What's that? Do you need a flashlight? No. No, because they're going in and. and blooper video the nest is uh, back in the wall somewhere or the ceiling or something we don't know exactly where um, so we're just gonna have to refer this one out to somebody who uses dust because uh, we don't want the customer doesn't want the wall opened up um, so yeah this is uh, gonna be a blooper all right thanks for watching go Eagles